Hey everybody, Rory from ANS Gear. We've got another Condor bag up on the table today. Condor Centurion duffel bag right here. So this is the kind of like a slash duffel backpack or it's a duffel bag that you can wear as a backpack because it does have backpack straps on it. Um, it's got one big open center cavity right there plus a couple little pockets around the outside of it. So let's take a look. Um, we've got Coyote Brown over here and we've got black. We're gonna move the black one out of the way. This one's a little bit easier to see. So we'll look through this one right here. We'll go ahead and get uh, get these things going. So I'm gonna open, I'm just gonna open all the straps up real quick so that we can get to the meat, the meat of the thing here. It does have one long duffel strap right here, which is adjustable. So if you want to hook this up and then come over your shoulder as a duffel bag, you can do that. Now this strap is removable completely. So if you don't want that on there, you can take it off. For some reason, I decided to keep that there. There we go. So and then you can take your strap off right there. Now this strap doesn't have any padded section to it or a, a wide pad for your shoulder or anything. It's just a duffel strap. But again, removable. Uh, all right, it does have one large carry handle section in the middle, so you can Velcro that, and then you could carry it like this as well. You could do that. It also has backpack straps. The straps are padded through here. They do not, as far as I see, have a chest harness across the middle. Um, but I don't know how much you can be carrying this as a backpack, maybe just for quick little trips or whatever. And uh, this definitely wouldn't be used as like an outdoor hiking or packing bag um, just because of the construction. So it's, it makes it easy to move around with. You can throw it on your back. You're going maybe from like an airport terminal to the car or whatever. But for extended packing, probably not what you're going to use. These straps can be removed from the bottom only. So if I pop that off of there and I pop that off of there, I can fold these up and get them out of the way. But also this section, this is gonna be our panel right here to get into the, the meat of the bag. This is Velcro right here. So this opens up and this whole thing is a pocket, but you could also take these straps and you could slide them down into here and you could get them out of the way. And then you could Velcro that. So you could get these backpack straps out of the way um, if you're just going to use it as a straight up duffel bag right there. Now this middle section right here is padded because this would be against your back if you were wearing it as a duffel bag or a backpack, sorry. Um, so having that little bit of extra padding on there is perfect. I'm going to leave these straps in for the moment so we can just kind of go around the rest of the bag. On the bag itself, at the very top, we do have a D-ring so that we can hang things from it or hook things to it. And then we do have a carry handle uh, up there on both the top and bottom so that you could pull it or carry it from either end. Now on both ends, we do have a zippered pouch and it runs the length of the end of the bag there. I can stand this up a little bit. That's the side, everything's backwards. Right there, so that's got a little pouch on the end right there. And then you get the same thing on the other side, except that you get two of them. So you get this little lower section right there. And then also you get a big open section right there. Now this does allow you to get um, kind of into the bag right here. So if you needed to use this uh, for a separate section to keep like dirty stuff away, you could do that. Or if you needed to open this up to fit something larger in the main section, you could do that as well. So you can kind of use it both ways. Um, either keep some stuff separate from what's inside the bag or uh, make it bigger. So we'll open that. Once we open this up, you'll be able to see that a little better. On this side here, we do have some webbing straps right there so we could uh, mount some stuff to it. We have a clear window for ID if we want to stick some 
uh, like, I don't know, some sort of identification in there. And then that does open up right there. So we have a nice long pocket so that we can get into that. And then this same kind of pocket is on the other side. But this other side does not have that identification window built into it right there. All right, so now let's open it up. We unzip the main middle. We can fold it open. On the uh, middle pouch, we have just a couple little pockets right there. You can get inside there. You could hold a couple things. But then this is our main pouch right here. It's big, it's open. It doesn't have any dividers or any sections inside of it besides the main section here and obviously the ability to make it bigger to go into this expanded section up here. You can push through to the front or we could have this part pushed in this way and then we could have stuff separate on this side. So, or you can just use it as a little pocket and not have it go anywhere. It's up to you. All right, so we've got a duffel bag that can double as a backpack. It's slightly expandable. You can make it bigger or you can have it two separate little sections right there. A couple little pockets around the outside. Comes in the coyote brown or the black. This is the Condor Centurion duffel bag. Order yours today through ansgear.com.